morning everyone it's a beautiful day um, it's October 24 today so I brought one of my flowers in that was blooming my hibiscus and it has 14 blooms on it so I'm really excited hoping it'll uh, bloom indoors since we've had some chilly nights so today I picked out a book called Peter Rabbit and I'm going to read you the story today once upon a time, there were four little rabbits, and their names were Flopsy, Mopsy, Cottontail, and Peter. They lived with their mother in a sandbank underneath the root of a very big fir tree. One morning, Mrs. Rabbit said, You may go into the fields or down the lane, but don't go into Mr. McGregor's garden. Your father had an accident there, and he was put in a pie by Mrs. McGregor. Then old Mrs. Rabbit took a basket and put her umbrella um, uh, and, she, and her umbrella, and she went through the woods to the baker's shop. Flopsy, Mopsy, Cottontail, they were good little bunnies. They went down the lane to gather blackberries. But Peter, who was very naughty, ran straight to Mr. McGregor's garden. He ate as many beans and radishes and carrots as he could, and then he felt sick, and he went to look for some parsley. Around the end of the cucumber frame, he met Mr. McGregor, who was planting young cabbages. When Mr. McGregor saw little Peter, he shouted, Stop, thief! Waving his hand spade, Mr. McGregor gave chase as Peter dashed away. Peter was dreadfully frightened, for he had forgotten the way back out of the garden. He lost his shoes and he began to run on all four legs, smack into a gooseberry net. The large buttons on his new blue jacket caught on the net but he managed to wiggle out of the jacket just as Mr. McGregor was ready to catch him. Then he rushed into the tool shed and he jumped into a can. It would have been a beautiful place to hide, but it was wet and cold inside. Peter sneezed and Mr. McGregor was after him again. Peter hopped out of the tool shed window, upsetting three flower pots. Finally, Peter found the garden gate. He slipped under it, and he was safe at last in the woods, outside the garden. Peter did not stop running until he got home. He was not very well that evening, so his mother put him to bed and gave him a dose of medicine. Flopsy. Mopsy and Cottontail ate berries and fresh bread for supper. Peter had learned a lesson, and soon the medicine would make him feel better. I hope you enjoyed that story. Thanks for listening. <laughs>